Amazon Wholesale in UK, eight minute tutorial, guys. I'm gonna show you step by step, explains you how wholesale in UK works on Amazon. So if you're looking for a video explanation, though it actually explains to you A to Z how wholesale works with no BS, straight to the point. I'm gonna do it, guys, right now, okay? My name is Andre Kreisberg, a full time Amazon seller here to help you guys win. Been doing this, guys, for the 10 plus years, Amazon and eBay seller. Yeah, guys, so it's been one of a journey, but we only have eight minutes where I'm going to explain to you guys how you can go and make those numbers, guys, selling on Amazon UK. Couple things, guys, before we go straight to the subject, because time is ticking. Um, the links are all below, guys, below my video. You can go and check out. You can follow my Telegram. In fact, you should sign up to my Telegram, subscribe. Uh, follow because I have a lot of good perks uh, information there. I do free training and etc. Bonuses, deals, uh, free links, everything's gonna be there. My guide and all that stuff. Okay. If you guys want to receive my additional private FBA guide to start selling on Amazon, make sure to comment word guide right now below this video, and I'll send it to you guys right away. Just give me a second. We can get this cracking right away. All right, guys. So. How does wholesale in UK works on Amazon? First of all, guys, you make a seller account on Amazon UK. It takes 20 minutes of your time. You go and use this link. I will make sure to put the link below in the description, guys, for you. Click sign up. You know, just make a seller account. It takes 20 minutes of your time. You need basic documents, your passport, your ID, your proof of address, your, you know, bank statement that shows, which is basically your proof of address anyway. Uh, you must have your credit card, your, your debit card to put on the file. You must have your banking uh, account information to get paid from Amazon and etc. Okay. So so you make, make a seller account and then you just go and start exploring and looking for wholesalers. Again, there's two methods you can go and use. The main methods, I would say, there are more out there, but I would say these are the most efficient ones that you can go, basically go and, um, and sort of tackle in. Uh, you start looking for wholesalers in UK using Google search, okay? So you can use different, uh, you know, um, uh, outsourcing directory websites and etc. You know, I use one called uh, eSources or Cottage UK. You can use a wholesaler as one as well. There's a wholesaler here. Basically, this, this is the website that gives you data base of all wholesales in UK and etc guys okay by the way guys as we're going for this video make sure to like this video make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel guys to keep me uh, in the ranking high and that really motivates me guys to push more content out for you guys hopefully you like the idea of today's a very quick video so if you're looking for no BS information this is the one okay so esources.co.uk uh, um, yeah again you can go and type anything random right here like for example toys you can look at wholesales in any category so you start looking for the categories you want you can also go by the categories that are opened on your seller central account on your Amazon if once you kind of get going you'll know for example home and kitchen category going to be open or you're looking to open toys and you go and find find a wholesaler like wild things toys for example you open them up you get you scroll down you click on you go on the actual website which is right here okay there's information here about the wholesaler you go to an actual website okay you pull up the website and then here you find the contact information top right corner click register so you fill in the form or whatever click register uh, it says keep in touch I mean usually not a very nice fancy website but you just fill in the form and etc sometimes they have a well most of the time they have phone numbers and etc you can actually go and give a call I recommend filling in the registration form I recommend giving them a call as well and start asking them if they, you know, if uh, if if it's okay to make a rapid um, trade account and etc. Guys, okay. After you've done a uh, registration form, remember one thing: wholesalers are looking to work with you because you're a business for them. They're looking to sell you um, their products. They're looking to do a business with you because they're actually making money from us as resellers. Just so you guys keep in mind, okay. Wholesalers do want to work with us, okay. And then after this, then they send you, you know, you basically talk to them. You ask them what they have an offer. You check the website. You check what products they have available. For example, this Wild Things toys. You look at the um, you know Fair Trade, whatever shop, whatever the shop, soft toys, rattles, and etc. So you get access to the actual website, to the actual prices. You can actually see the prices before even getting a website. Usually, that's not the case with the wholesalers. And after this, they usually send you what's called a price list, which looks like this. Okay, that's what the prices looks like. I just pulled a random price list from one of our wholesalers. We use we use a tool called Scan Unlimited, guys. By the way, to scan wholesalers and. Um, this is just a random, like, like kind of like a UPL, UPC code with the UPC code, kind of a price already, already scanned uh, price list for, um, um, you know, uh, from one of our wholesalers where you have the product ID, you have your cost, you got your ASINs, you got your sales rank over here, you got your title of the product. And then you put that, you know, basically that price list will 
put that against Amazon. They give you the prices, you know, the raw file. You put that against Amazon and see what's actually profitable for you or not. You do your own research and etc. And you start pulling up products like this. For example, this is a wholesale called Jones. Just wanted to give you guys an example, okay? There's just some random uh, Arden Sunflowers gift set. I'm not logged into this wholesale right now. We have an account for them. But, um, you know, they are selling the set on Amazon for $17.16. So I'm not sure how much we've been buying this one for. But this is just an example of a wholesale product, okay? $17.16. And, um, yeah. Yeah, so again, you go and log into the website and you just place an order from them. You order how much quantity you want, and then you start shipping the products over to the prep center. Bear in mind, guys, you're piggybacking on existing listing already. You piggyback on this listing. You don't make your own listing. You don't create anything from scratch. You take, you find the product. You find the products from the from the price list. You see them on Amazon. You add them to your Amazon inventory, and then you go and make a purchase, and you send them over to what's called a prep center, a special warehouse facilities that will do your own prepping and packing for you. They do all the prepping and packing for you guys, okay? You can do your own prepping and packing, guys, if you live in the UK, that's fine. You know, if you live somewhere else in USA and stuff, you might need to use a prep center. I recommend using a prep center because prep center is going to save you tons of your time. Prep center is just, you know, time is money, guys. That's just the way it works. Guys, by the way, where are you from? What country? Maybe not from UK or what city in UK, guys, watching from? Let me guys know. I've got two minutes to go. I'm sure I can fit it all in. But yeah, guys, hopefully you're enjoying the content. So comment, guys, where you're from. Don't forget to comment throughout the guide below this video, guys. Don't forget to follow my Telegram and subscribe to my social medias as well, guys, for more information. Okay, so yeah. And then after this, you send over to the prep center. They'll charge you like a like less than a pound per item to prepping and packing, to prep and pack the product. And then it goes over to... um. Uh, then it goes over to Amazon FBA after that to the Amazon fulfillment warehouses and you become one of the sellers once the once your products land over to Amazon you become one of the sellers on the platform and you basically would look like this look CA products UK dispatches from Amazon it's gonna be like you Jamie's store and dispatches from Amazon you're gonna be uh, as an FBA seller you're gonna be selling it as an FBA seller and that Amazon does all the fulfilling shipping on our behalf and that's why we pay the fee uh, to sell on the platforms for example here if you were to go and buy this set for example for Fiverr, 631 is your profit, minus, you know, 1739 is your sell price, minus uh, five pounds, and minus 631, you will calculate how much commission you will pay. So Amazon usually is 15% to sell on the platform, and there's going to be an additional, like, you know, whatever fixed fee for them to fulfill your product and send them over to your custom. They do all the fulfillment for you guys, guys, okay, yeah? So yeah, that's how the process basically works. Then you also can go and do an outsource your products research, wholesale research using virtual assistants through a website called Online Jobs PH. It's a website I recommend to hire Filipino VAs from. I personally hire from there. We pay them $200, $300, $400 per month for 40 hours of work per week. That's like £250 per month for 40 hours of work per week. That's a good money for them. We pay them. Some of them we pay more, of course. Uh, you know, Some we pay less. We start on less and then we upgrade them casually as we go. And that's basically how it, how it works. And then you can outsource your entire business model and then you can live the freedom lifestyle. Okay, You don't have to do even re products research, wholesale research, and etc. Yourself. but obviously you want to go and start doing yourself so yeah that's basically how the concept works wholesale amazon wholesale in uk in just eight minutes guys hopefully guys you've enjoyed this video hopefully this was valuable we managed to fit it all in and um yeah you just rinse repeat the process you make a seller account you're looking for wholesalers you you register an account you get a price list from them you start looking for products from the price list you're taking the products from the price list you see if you can sell them on amazon or what you what you want to sell what's profitable for you and then you send all those products over to you know you make an order you send them over to the prep center they do repacking for your relabeling and send it over to your amazon store for you and then once it lands it starts selling and just rinse the repeat the process you get paid out to your bank account you just reinvest money back into the business you collect the profit you keep it back in the business anyway guys i know it's fast but this is meant to be a very fast guide all right for those of you guys that are listening hopefully guys you've enjoyed it okay so like this video uh subscribe to this youtube channel guys i appreciate you if you found a lot of information please do give me guys a thumbs up subscribe comment guys saying something like great great info whatever i appreciate that it just helps me to boost the, uh, the algorithms of the youtube channel etc so i can make more content for you guys okay don't forget to subscribe don't forget to comment word guide and i'll see you guys on my future videos Bye bye